so should the woman go out for eid prayer it is mentioned in the hadith of sahih bukhari hadith number 971 from uh, umm atiyah radhiyallahu anha she said that kunna numaru an nakhruja yawm al eid that she said we were commanded to go out that is to the place of eid prayer on the day of eid she said that they, they were commanded that the women were commanded that is she said that even the young girls that is to bring out the young girls and hatta nukhrij al hijaza that even to bring menstruating women to the place of prayer that is eid prayer she said that we were commanded that is a woman were commanded to go out for the eid prayer that is the place of eid prayer the young girls even the menstruating women even though that menstruating women they cannot pray they will praise allah they will say takbir and they will uh, invoke allah and they will seek the blessings on the day of eid at the place of eid prayer even though they cannot pray menstruating women they cannot pray because they are not pure to pray even then prophet commanded them that is to bring the young girls and even the menstruating women so it is very much encouraged for women to go to the place of eid prayer that is to pray so this shows that is their uh, women are encouraged to go out for eid prayer on the day of eid because they were commanded by prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam and th that is uh, this is to publicize that is the islamic manners and is the islamic prayer and the islamic tradition that is to publicize that's why prophet commanded them that is to go out for eid prayer that is on the day of eid so uh, no one should prevent women from going to the place of eid prayer but what we see today that usually very few places have the arrangements for uh, women to come and pray there so hope we can increase the number of places where the where women can go and pray on the day of eid